Uh, I got a request to do this one. Uh, it's a tune off the Hamilton County Ramblers album. The name of the core is gone. Uh, it's a uh, it's old flat and scrug standard, but we did a little different and uh, being being somewhat lazy and being you know that I I didn't want to have to retune my banjo or do anything particularly odd on the uh, you know in a set. I, I, I pretty much play it out of standard G tuning. I, I do tune the uh, fifth string down to an F sharp. So I'm going to start with the tuning. So it's just... Uh, and so the, the fifth string's down to an F sharp. So just one fret lower. Uh, it's a slow break. There's not a lot that goes on in it. But one of the things I do... One of the things I do in it is uh, there's I, I do some pre bends and and let them down to a note. So that very first note, it's a third string note. So I go ahead and get it pre bent, and and I like to try to get it pre bent to the actual note. So that's my first little thing I'm doing. I'm doing that's five three one five. And that's just a bend up and down. And try to bend them in tune. Uh, uh, a tip on the bend is hit the note, then bend. Hit the note, unbend, whichever, but hit the note first. And then there's a little hammer hat. So it's a hammer from seven to nine on the third. And then the fifth right after. And then we're, index is going to go to the first string. So we just walk up. To that after that bend so everything to there there's that hammer again and then the index finger is going to go to uh, seventh fret and pretty much any roll will work here uh, I, I kind of try to do it with a uh, with a reverse feeling thing So, but I change that just about every time I play it, but you can do it as a stand, just a standard reverse, so one, three, five, one, three, so that's the roll we're going to, and there does that. So that's where we are there. So we're going to bend up. And so we're going to bend up two, one, five, two, one, five. And to get that note in tune, you have to be real careful because uh, you can hit that. You can wind up bending it far enough that you're going to mute that uh, fifth string accidentally. So you have to be real careful. I mean, it's. I mean, I'm just right there on the fifth with that bend. And then. And that's another pre bend or unbend. So let's see. That's how I end the end. So, one more time through, just kind of slow. Fortunately, it's a slow song.
So good luck with it. Uh, have fun. Core is gone.